All right, guys. Ready for church? Dad, can we stop somewhere? I have to pee. I just, I told you to go before we left. Dad, I have to pee too. Stop it. Stop. Calm down. Just calm down. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Dad. 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 Dad, did you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Dad, you know, did you know that zippers, they were made, uh, they were made to go up and down. <laughs> to be that. Is there a bottle back there? Where am I gonna go? I'm gonna go in my pants. We're almost there, okay? I'm thirsty, Dad. Dad, can we get a donut afterward? You don't need a donut. Dad, how long until we're there? How long do we have, Dad? <sighs> Dad, why do you look like that? Dad, I have to pee and I'm thirsty at the same time. Guys, we're almost there, okay? Just calm down. Dad, I'm thirsty. You guys. Dad, I have to pee, I'm hungry and I'm thirsty. Dad. 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 Just calm down. Dad, I have to pee, I'm hungry and I'm thirsty. Daddy. Dad. 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 Be hungry, thirst. Be hungry, thirst. Dad. 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 Okay, we're here. Get out of the car! When you mix faith with the vibration of thought, it sinks into your subconscious and is transmitted to the infinite intelligence. Uh, it's a lot of words, but simply put, if you have faith with emotion and the right thoughts, it will happen. Faith, love, and sex are the most powerful of the positive emotions. And when you mix them all and blend them all together, you get a direct line to the infinite intelligence. Hey Lord, it's me again. Yeah. Andrew, great to hear from you, my son. What can I do for you? Yeah, just calling to make sure everything's going good. Uh, just make sure I'm doing the right thing, you know? Yeah, absolutely. Believe that you receive it and you shall have it. You would know. Alpha and Omega and all that. What do I tell you? Who's the best? Okay. Amen, you know? Yeah, thanks for life and all that. Talk to you later. All right, talk to you soon. Amen. Through repetition of affirmations, you can develop faith. Yeah, I dare you to take a bicycle. Kids don't choose to be criminals. They get a taste of it, and then once they're around it and are influenced by crime, they accept crime and become a part of it. What? I'm not gonna take a bike, man. Why would you even say that? Why would you even say that? Okay. We got a bikes for sale. Bikes for sale here. We got a whole lot. These are my bikes, okay? Not your bikes anymore. What'd I tell you? What'd I tell you? It's 25 a piece. 25 a piece. Okay, this is my empire. 25 a piece, 25, 30, 30. All right, we got 30 right here in the nice pretty blue. So any thought that you think about, good or bad, on a daily basis, repetitively, and with emotion, will get brought out into the physical world. There are millions of people whose daily thoughts are lack, struggle, not good enough, and that's exactly what you'll get because that's what thought energy is giving you. You can change your automatic thought patterns with auto-suggestion which are the automatic thoughts that you think about on a daily basis. I like to do this when I'm going for a jog or for a run. I am happy. I am healthy. I am wealthy. And as I jog, it sinks into my nervous system, so I believe it. The military does it the same way with their soldiers. When you move and physically get into it and say it out loud, it programs their minds into their subconscious and into their nervous system, so they believe it. Sure could use some silent death. OP right, this is you and me. OP right, this is you and me. Looking down at the enemy. So if you have something that you think about on a daily basis that you just can't seem to get over, think about the opposite of whatever that thing is and physically move your body and get into it. So if you think about lack or scarcity or poverty, I am wealthy. I am a money magnet. I have tons of money flowing in. Move your body while you get into it. If you think of disease or death, I am healthy. I am health. I am healed. I am healthy. I am happy. I am healthy. <laughs> Crazy. Hey, Lord, it's me again. Andrew, great to hear from you. How can I help? Just don't know if I'm ready. 
yeah, I just, I, I don't think I'm ready for this. Well, you'll never be ready, my son. That's the beautiful thing. Okay. How about Moses? You think he was ready? You would know. Start right now. All right. Amen. All right. Love you. Talk to you soon. Talk to you later. Faith is miracles. Faith is the only antidote for failure. And faith with direct prayer and belief gives you a direct line of communication to the infinite intelligence. Hey, Lord, just wondering if you got my message about the corn. Yeah, we're, we're in need. Um, there's nothing growing right now. I know, you know, I know, it, I know it's coming, but we're, <laughs> we're hungry. I know we're just... <gasps> oh my gosh! You did it again! It's a miracle! Henry Ford said, whether you think you can or you can't, you're right. So if you think you're beaten, you are. If you think you're poor, you are. If you think you can't have that, you won't. If you think you aren't good enough, you aren't. Jesus was so insistent on belief. It says in the Bible over 60 times, what ye desire, if ye pray and believe, ye shall receive. 